Hi, Sammy and Mabuhay. Welcome back to Philly Swiss. In this video, we are doing another unboxing because we got our Wolf Club box. So, okay, this is the March box. And I've already pre-opened it and I know Snickers has been waiting for this box to be opened as you can see He's on standby to do some lovely testing with us. So now let's get straight on to the unboxing And the second obstacle is also gone. All right. Also, if you want to order a box of your own for your lovely popper, uh, you can use our code SNICKERS10 to get a 10% discount. And of course, I will leave the list of countries where they ship in the description below. So you can just check it out if they cover your country. So now we have the usual cover and it has this lovely picture. The Happy Easter Box. Somebody loves you. Oh, yes, so cute. Somebody loves you. That's usually us. <laughs> woof woof Snickers. Hello again from the Wolf Club. Easter is just around the corner and each year we see the Easter Bunny arrive with lots of snacks and treats for our two-legged friends. Why don't they leave any chocolate eggs for us, I wonder? We love surprises and tasty snacks too. Well, this year, get ready to unpack a perfectly wonderful box of Easter-themed gifts to delight even the most discerning doggy. You're not discerning at all. You will find a selection of exciting toys and bunny-licious snacks so that you can join in all the Easter fun too. I love this. Oh my god. Okay, guess what? There is a doggy chocolate surprise too. Who said dogs can't eat chocolate? Here's wishing you a positively fabulous Easter. Whoops and belly rubs, the Wolf Club team. P.S. Your little chick Easter eggs contain 80% British venison, vegetable glycerin, potato, and minerals. Enjoy! Also, don't forget to follow the Wolf Club on Instagram. I will leave their handle in the description box as, uh, description box as well below. And yeah, so don't forget to check out their website to see what fun stuff they have in store for your little furry friend. And it's also available for cats as well. They have the Meow Box and our code also works for that. Oh, look at this. Oh, my God, the Easter Bunny. It's called Doggy Pasta. Yeah, yeah, Doggy Pasta. And it looks like it's much more tastier than our pasta. So it's by Antos. Yes, we like the Antos treats last time. That's really good. All natural dog chews. Hypoallergenic. Okay. Feed material, not for human consumption. Well, I usually don't want to, you know, um, try out his treats. One, there's something about this thing that I just don't like. And number two, mm, I don't think it's going to be that tasty for us. But. Let's have a taste test with Snickers and see if he will approve these treats. It's usually difficult to find something he doesn't like or like. So, let's do this for the purpose of testing. So, you've seen me magically pull it out. Ideally, they're long sticks. So, just for Snickers. Snickers, come on. You wanna try this? He's hmm? not that curious. Have a sniff. You can see his nose, his nose is activating. And do you like it? You wanna try it? Okay. Oh, how gentle. He took it very gently. Mm-hmm. And and mm. Alright, it looks like he approved it. Maybe not as exciting as the other treats as usual, but he approves. That means it will not go to waste and we can find a way to actually integrate this into our training. So we're gonna try out some new tricks with him and also going back through our old tricks just to, you know, give some refreshers as well that he doesn't forget them. All right, up next. Oh, they're Easter egg biscuits. Look at that, they're so colorful and cute. Oh my goodness, I wonder what they're made of. 
Okay, so obviously this is going to ah this is from France. I see. Okay. Okay, it does have flour. Okay. Honey and other stuff like yogurt. Not sure what the others are since I don't use those French words in the first place. But these are definitely safe for dogs. So I'm just gonna have to open it and have our test tester give his uh, seal of approval. Look at the decoration! Oh, so Easter festive. Alright, you ready for this? You're sitting on my pillow, you know? Alright, high five! Oh, you have a good boy! Alright. And, and takes it away. It's a good sign. It means he doesn't want to share it. Okay, he's enjoying. Snickers approved, guys! Yay! So, alright, so that's another biscuit done. I have a strong feeling I will end up buying a smallerish uh, cookie jar just for him because I'm not going to mix our cookies with his cookies. Easter uh, eggs! They're like chicky eggs! So they're basically these yellow plastic eggs. Like If you remember when you were a kid, then you would go Easter egg hunting and then what's inside is filled with goodies. I have a strong feeling. Yeah! You hear that? You hear that? There's going to be lovely treats inside. Oh my goodness. Chicky, it's oh. so cute. You see snakes? Yeah. I'm not gonna let you play with this toy. It might choke you, but definitely the contents. Oh, look at that. I was thinking it was gonna be chocolate inside, but so it actually allows you to, to keep it open in this way. You see, there's a little connection, but when you open it, Look at that pot of gold. It's all meat treats. Oh my goodness. This is what they were saying. You like the meat treats, isn't it? Maybe you don't even need to test it anymore. <laughs> I'm, I was right. He wouldn't have needed any testing. This was so going to happen anyway. But oh my god. This is so cute. I love this one. Snickers will love. So it's a bouquet of legs or feet. No, it's feet of different <laughs> feet jerky <laughs> look at those okay i'm not gonna i'm not gonna have to give you one now for the testing i know you can do the sniff test at least huh? sniff 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 yes so these will be his after bath treats because you know he's such a trooper whenever he gets a bath <laughs> Usually he runs away once we've turned on the water and then the door remains open and like Snickers, it's time for a bath and it becomes a long chase of um, uh, the tortoise and the hare at home so he's such a trooper in his bath so we're gonna give that as his lovely reward for being a good boy in the bathroom by the way there's no difficult difficulty with him when he is in the shower already so that's a good thing now, next one. Oh my goodness, it's a rosewood product. Okay, leaps and bounds wolf bar peanut chocolate. Look at that peanut chocolate. It's the dog safe alternative to chocolate. Okay, complimentary pet food for dogs for animal consumption only. Yes, <laughs> I would agree. Feed as a treat anytime as part of a well balanced diet. Yes, you get that. We recommend two to five pieces a day, depending on the size of your dog. Always provide fresh water for your pet. Yes, because we get so thirsty. All right, so um, since he's tiny and they say two to five pieces a day, I think maybe um, two to three maximum we would give him. So let's just see how it's uh, how it looks like. Snickers. <laughs> That's not even treats on the floor. That's just the stuff that comes out from the packaging. All right. Okay, I'm not good at opening, right? I have to destroy it. Alright. So, someone's curious. Oh, okay, so, it's this kind of color for some reason. So, it is the same color as they were showing in the packaging. So, I break off one now, at least just one. So, we have one of these chocolatey peanut buttery treats. Come on. Oh, you good boy. Sit. Wait. Paul. Good boy. Yeah. Mm hmm. 
Do you like peanut butter, Snake? You like peanut butter? Chewy. <laughs> All right, so it looks like it's Snickers approved. There are no remains, so we can move on. I think that was the last of the trees. Yes, it was. Now we're heading on straight to the other products. If I could just remove this stuff here. So, what do we have here? Ooh, another Rosewood product. So, Rosewood, it's a pet thing. Yes. Rosewood, it's a pet thing. Travel. Two-in-one bath and groom pet brush. Compact and portable. Filled with water or shampoo. Lifts dirt and mud. Oh, that's cool. All right. It dispenses shampoo or water whilst grooming the pet. To use, simply twist open the valve and fill the brush with water or your pet's favorite shampoo. Perfect for on the go and ideal for travel. Le uh, lifts dirt, mud, and dead hair. All right. So okay. So you can see that there's space to fill in the water mixed with shampoo. So obviously, dog shampoo, beagle, or cat shampoo if you think you're gonna bathe your cat. But you can see here, there's the brush, and it's not with bristles. It's um, it's one of those things. <laughs> if only I could describe that well. And I think yes, this is something that is just it's kept for some reason. What is this for massaging? What does it say? Are there instructions? Um, open lock. Oh, okay. So if you twist it, one side is to open. Like, if only I was reading it right. So if you twist this plastic knob, one is one side is to open and then one is to lock it so that the um, the, the shampoo water mix can actually come out and then you can do your thing with your your little pearly brain. But I'm not doing a good job twisting for some reason. Okay, I'm sure I'll I'll figure this out, but it's not twisting. So. I'm just gonna assume that the twist and lock feature was just to get this off, this little cap. Because this cap has the center block and there's a little hole where the liquid will actually come out from here. So if the twist and lock is just for the purpose of taking this uh, plastic seal out or uh, cover out, then, then that must be it. Otherwise, you can always let me know in the comment section below if I did something wrong. But this is the duck and the snakes, they speak German. Tierspielzeug, pet toy. Handgemacht, sorry, let me just stick to the English one. Handmade, pure cotton, machine washable, dyed with natural colors, helps to clean the teeth. Certified quality product. All right, so Laboni Design. So you just have to go to their website. Oh, Zurich. Okay, they're in Zurich. Why don't I see them? <laughs> I think because I haven't gone out for a while. I've been uh, cooked up here in my little studio. Okay, IDA Design Award Silver Winners. And here's Emma the Duck. Emma Ente. Quack, quack, quack. All right. It doesn't look like she's gonna squeak anytime soon. She does have a ribbon, which I think I could actually remove in case he does end up pulling the ribbon out. It's, uh, it only says uh, Laboni, which is the name of uh, the brand. So here it is, in case you were wondering. And the website is Laboni. That this uh, dot design. So just search for Laboni. Snickers. You wanna play with Emma? You wanna play with Emma? Now, um, obviously, that's the end of our show because we don't have anything else to unbox or test. And. From this box or this month's box, it appears that it's all Snickers approved. So thank you very much for watching. I hope we get to see you next time. Don't forget to click the subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this. And also the bell to be notified for future videos. Don't forget to like this video if you actually enjoyed watching our little mini testing. I'll see you next time and schöne and paalam.